underneath the glove box, we're gonna take this panel off, take these screws out, use a seven millimeter socket. Right there. Grab the panel. Just slide it out. It is connected right there. It's okay. There's a couple of wires underneath here. You wanna pop those off. Just slide a trim tool underneath and just pry these up. Try not to break it. And if there's a connector connected to them, that's okay. Don't worry about it. You don't have to disconnect them. And slide that out of the way. Disconnect the connector to the resistor. You might need a hook or a pick. It's kind of hard to see. Basically, I'm taking the hook and getting behind the clip, popping that off and then sliding it down. Now use a 5.5 millimeter socket and take these two bolts out. There's one. Those up and grab the resistor and just slide it down. Now you can disconnect the resistor from the blower motor. Now you can push on the connector. You use a screwdriver or a pick. Slide the connector off. like that. This is how you disconnect the connector if you didn't see it too well. Just take a pick and just push on that and you should be able to slide the connector off. And take the new resistor. You can plug it into the blower motor if you want at this point. Line that up. All right, lock that down. And line the resistor up. Tighten these down. Just snug them up to our tightening down in plastic, so it's not too tight. Take the connector, line the connector up, and lock it down. Now put this panel in position, re-secure the wires, the connectors. In the retainers. Put the two screws in. Down. Just snug them up. 